feel like they have got everything in line. Problems once again. This time it's the 82 of Sean Core into the inside wall hard. You see the debris up the racetrack. Here's one trying to avoid. He'll slide back up the racetrack. That is the 12 of Russ Duggar. He came out of any other vehicles, gets it straightened back out. Could have easily went head on into the outside wall, did a nice job of getting the brakes and stopping that car before he did. There's the damage to the 82 of Sean Core, though. That brings out our fifth caution. Sean was one of the cars that was on the lead lap, had a top 15 run going. A lot of damage, though. It looks very similar to Tom Birdie's car, the 35 car, that hit that inside wall coming off turn two a little while ago. As we are now at the halfway point of this race. Out in front, Craig Ghost. And problems for Sean Core in the 82. Let's take another look. He's already made some contact. See the 12 of Russ Duggar decides to go to the inside, loses the back end, but does a nice job holding the brakes on that car. He had some other traffic coming along the outside. See, Sean, he just gets a little bit loose right behind the 44 of Frank Kimmel. Then he tries to chase it up the hill, loses control, comes down off the off the banking into the outside, much like Tom Birdie did. Yep, hits that safer barrier, just the the beginning of it on the inside wall. Does a lot of damage to the inside. And there you see Russ Duggar in that 12, wanting to go to the inside, but carrying a lot of speed, got sideways. We have the we car. have the advantage of being up high there. There was a lot of smoke probably from from Sean's car. When Russ Duggar came along, you see the smoke right there. That smoke's a lot worse for those drivers coming than it is for us looking at it from this angle. It looks like Russ Duggar was coming up behind Rob Brent as well. Makes a little contact with that inside wall. It was on the back bumper of the 36 and looked like he was trying to avoid that. And then all of a sudden there was the 82 of Sean Kaur. So continued even further to the inside, but kept it straight. Russ Duggar turned the wheel so hard that that's why he lost the back end as he went to the inside of Sean Core. A lot of damage to the front end of the 82. That will be, I'm sure, the end of the day for Sean Core as he will go behind the wall and into the garage. It's Craig Ghost out in front of the field now. James Busher chasing. Chad Finley, Justin Marks running fourth, and Nelson PK. Rounding out our top five. Sean Core wild ride into the inside wall brings out our fifth caution.